guys welcome back to my channel if you are new here my name is Teresa. i'm a content creator based in the Kora state nigeria and if you love us already consider subscribing just turn on that subscribe button below turn on post notification that's notified when i post a new content and to my returnees thank you guys for coming back to watch my video i really appreciate so well, before we continue make sure you give this video a thumbs up comment share and don't worry i will appreciate that just do those three for me be cool so today i'll be sharing with us some fun facts you probably didn't know about ghana or let's say some interesting fact about ghana that you probably didn't know and i'm not saying you don't know them you might be familiar with some of them and some you might not know but before you comment make sure you watch this video till the end after listening to what i want to say so if there are some facts that i didn't mention in this video let me know down there in the comment section because we keep learning every day the first of my list is the culture and tradition of the Ghanaian people of west africa is mixed especially due to the fact that most of several opposed that uphold their different cultural as well as their varied ways of life so that is my number so traditionally ghana as a nation was divided into three castes royals mm -hmm. commoners and so the, the traditional class stratification is still recognized but the slavery is not recognized or is not prominent in ghana another thing i have here is polygamy in ghana is legal polygamy in ghana is legal and people do not have problem with polygamous family as long as the breadwinner of the family can't provide for the need so if you can why not so traditional practices on widow inheritance is still practiced in ghana and that is when the brother or the late husband gets married to the widow so they do this because they believe that the brother will be able to take care of the kids and also the so wife. generally ghanaian culture lay more emphasis on being hospitable good manners being respectful be social and from what i've had so far i had ghanaians are friendly people so that's why i said that very soon i would love to visit ghana so if you are a ghanaian watching this and you would love me to come to your country let me know down there in the comments okay so my number six is uh with time and changes that is going on in the world today especially in the aspect of religion so most Ghanaians are not they are not involved or they've not been involved in themselves in polygamous marriage anymore especially those practicing christianity so as soon as you are christian or uh, christianity or if you are practicing if you are a christian you are not allowed to get married to more than one wife one wife one husband okay so my number seven we have the uh, official language of ghana is english language although there is this Ghana accent that if for example now the way I'm pronouncing all what I'm saying a Ghanaian won't pronounce it like this they kind of have this their accent that I even think I love so my number eight is um Ghana had their first constitution in 1940 so after Ghana uh, gained independence in 1957 Kwame Nkrumah became the first president of the independent nation so, the next of my list is Ghanaians they enjoy dancing playing drums and they like food so if you are a Ghanaian watching this let me know in the comment section if that fact is true maybe you guys really love eating or it's just an exaggeration or just a misconception let me know down in the comment section so the last of my list is religiously Ghana has Muslims, they have Christians and other types of religion that they practice. So we've come to the end of this video. So don't go away yet. Just binge watch my content. You can click on this. Mm -hmm.